Hey there, how's it going, John? Uh, so this is the 2015 Canyon that we do have in. Sorry about the late reply, but hey, better late, better uh, late than never, eh? So yeah, as you can see, we'll take a look underneath the hood here. Uh, it does have the 3.6 DVT uh, with all your fucking, all, all your fixings and all the rest of it. Uh, fuse is located right here. Battery, uh, engine oil, uh, depository engine oil, dipstick down here, air box, coolant. Um, Windshield washer is located right here. Everything's really nicely, easily laid out for you. That's what I like about GMs. I'm, I've been a GM guy since I can re always remember. So, uh, yeah. It does have a nice, slim uh, bug deflector on it right here. You wouldn't notice unless I told you. Um, as you can see, they, they did re redesign the canyons for this year. And they look awesome. They're definitely a nice showstopper. Uh, better looking than the Fords, as the dog is, to say the least. Uh, it's got all the chrome. The nice LED headlights on this guy, as well as the fog lamps located down here. Projectors make it really bright, so it's very sharp, very good unit. So we'll come around the side here. As you can see, it does have the 18-inch rims. Uh, with uh, These are nitrogen-filled tires as well. Uh, basically, that just means it's a little bit more stable, but you can always fill them up with air. There's no issue there. It does have the nice running boards along with the chrome located up here. So I'll take you around back to take a look at this guy. It does have the nice side exhaust on it as well. So, uh, I'll show you in the back here. It does have the GMC tonneau cover on it as well, as well as a nice redesigned uh, taillights here as well. So it does have bed liner sprayed inside here. Uh, very good, lots of space for a smaller uh, quarter ton truck. It's basically everything you can need in this guy. So, the camera wants to just follow me over here. Um, we do have the USBs as well as a 12 volt located in the back, including the two-tone leather seats. So it's got leather up on the doors here and then uh, uh, darker leather on the doors with a medium color and then the nice tan as well, which are uh, which falls through the truck. So if you want to hop in the back there. Mr. Cameraman. Oh. All right, so I'll turn this guy on. So this guy is the full load. Basically, it's got all the... Uh, fancy things that you could possibly need in it, including your tow haul located right here, trash control, uh, your cargo light, and then it does have uh, 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 monitors for when you're driving down the high, blind spot monitors, that's the word I was looking for. It does have those, so it's located on the side, so your mirrors are going to flash when uh, someone's getting a little bit closer, you're trying to uh, lane switch. Um, in the front here, as you can see, uh, like totally redesigned, I'll say that once, I'll say it again, uh, it does have your OnStar, uh, it does have the navigation as well, if this guy's going to load. So navigation, heated seats, you have another USB and an auxiliary located down there. You do have the option to shift it manually as well. And uh, it does also have the backup camera located right there. In the interior, this guy, just glove box is absolutely huge with another USB. So you can always be charging your phone, always be good to go. And um, up here, nice big glove box with the original manual in it. So you know what, John? Um, I'm not gonna be. I'm not gonna lie to you or nothing like that. We have three other salesmen trying to sell this right now because this is the only one on the market right now for sale of its kind. So um, get back to me when you can. Uh, we'll stay in touch, and I'd love to see you this weekend. Thank you. Have yourself a good one, and we'll talk then.